Okay, I'm so appreciative to your emotions because that we, we have to show our emotions because that what that's what writers do. Mm -hmm. And that m emotion that she showed, it's going to come out in her work for yes. others. And that's, that's the passion that we have. And so I see those pages in the hand. I'm so happy because I know where we were last week. Right. Yes. So we were ready uh, to do more of this. Uh, and you think that this is something. Yeah, I've always known and believe every day that my avenue for writing is those moments without distraction and those kinds of things. And, you know, when the motivation hits, I do my best work when I can just roll with it. And as we all know, you get interrupted, you get a phone call, you get a responsibility, something. Um, and again, just to be able to just sit and do what I said probably 15 minutes before that I needed to do. And that's write the book that I started to write without all the bells and the whistles and shake the box two and three and four. Um, I just need to write this book. And selfishly, I think like you're saying, um, I'm not preaching to my own self. Um, the messages that I have for other people, they're going to get it or they're not. Um, because the genuineness of the story that I'm telling is going to teach in and of itself. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I don't think I have to do right. anything other than just tell the story. So that's the part that I think um, the quiet time did for me today. And, you know, I didn't bring my laptop today for a couple of different reasons, but one of the things that does happen in my journal is what I found myself doing here. You know, I write as much as I can. Sometimes it's a complete sentence. Sometimes it's a list. Sometimes it's a thought. Sometimes it says color this. Sometimes there's an open space that I know exactly how I'm going to fill it. But if I stop to fill it, I'll lose the rest. Um, and when Ms. Millie called time, I was at a place where there is an exact lesson about shaking the box. Through my journey of joy and pain, I realized the judgment of people who are with you in those processes. And when they read the book, I got to decide whether I want to call them by name or alter that. But the, the truth in the lesson that they teach me as I shake my own boxes is amazing and cleansing. So I want to say to you that I am ecstatic because this is what... I have been pulling for on you. Mm. And I don't know if anybody have ever noticed, I constantly said to her, and it's even in my forward that I said about you, is that when you told me it was Shake the Box, you had not told me that it really was going to be things about more about Grandma, but mm. I felt that because you, you told us a little bit about her, her being a very important part of your growth and all mm. this. And I've been crying for that, and I'm finally getting it. I'm so happy. Mm. You're on a roll. Thanks. God bless.